Continental Couture took to the catwalks last night as African Fashion International got underway. Founded in 2007, the week aims to promote trends in society through clothing. The fashion extravaganza is taking place at the Santon Convention Center. Our reporter Ndundu Sitole got the inside info from the red carpet, chatting to the founder and director of AFI, Dr. Precious Maloy Matepe, who's hoping fashion and music can unite the continent. You founded this platform in 2007. What is it that you are hoping to achieve? Wow, um, it's, it's really been a long way coming. You know, Africa is such a special continent. I mean, if you think about it, more than one, we, we're close to more than 1.2 billion people, a huge economy, you know, our GDP, something like three trillion dollars. Um, there is so much wealth on this continent below the earth, the human resources that we have, the raw materials that we have, we have so much to offer the world and we have to make sure that we make our mark in terms of what we export into the world. I think uh, we have, we, we're very rich in, in, in our culture and in our heritage and that brings such a huge differentiator into the global apparel, fashion, clothing industry. Um, my wish was to see the African people working together, sharing ideas, creating amazing um, clothing, creating amazing music, um, you know, movies that we can export to the world because that's where our strength lies. You believe that Africa can unite through diversity. With what is going on in the country um, currently with the ongoing uh, violence, so-called xenophobia yes. attacks and all of that. Why do you think it's important to call on that, um, you know, Africa unites uh, message? We are all one people. We are all Africans. You know, we, um, we, we share so much in common. You saw the music. You yeah. saw we've enjoyed African food. You know, we've enjoyed African apparel clothing. We are one people. We need to come together and because it is in our unity that we become prosperous, a prosperous nation, that we become successful and really dominate the world um, and, and um, offer the best of Africa. So this show was purely dedicated to uniting all Africans. We've got to forget our differences and, and really focus on what brings us together. You think fashion and music can achieve that? You know, our culture, Culture unites people. There are, there are few things that can do as well as um, the creative industry. It's the sports, you know, sports unites people. Music unites people. And I think our dress, our fashion, you know, also unites us. And you could see uh, at the shows today, we had Pan-African designers. Amazing, vibrant clothing from all four regions of the continent. The important thing now is that we must make sure that we, chain, we turn that into commercially viable businesses, create jobs for our people um, so that we can stop this, um, you know, the, the, the results of uh, poverty and employment is what we saw with people creating friction between each other. How important is this platform, especially for up-and-coming um, so-called newcomers, up-and-coming designers? I think the future belongs to young people and these up and coming designers are the, are the ones that are going to dictate where we're going in the world. The future of Africa belongs with young people.